Welcome back folks to Let's Play Bodus Gate the Announced Edition. Last time we left off we completed the candle keep. So what we're going to do no 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 Iman, Iman. I'm on it. What we're gonna do today is quite simple. We're gonna go to the friendly Hello arm inn. Hello there. Well, a busy day for me indeed. Strange noises throughout the night, and now a plethora of people strolling about the wood. You do look like a touch more hospitable than the last two I met though. Well met, stranger. I'm called Colsid. Uh, I would have your assistance. You, I was ambushed in the night and I require whatever you can give. I have little to give besides advice and goodwill. Make friends wherever you can, as traveling alone is almost certain death. You will want to surround yourself with like-minded companions, lest you risk making enemies of your own party. Aside from this little tidbit of wisdom, let's say you're on your own. Luck be with you. Thanks for nothing. Okay, in this game it pays to be a douchebag. Game leads you to be one. That makes sense. Uh, the Gibberling is attacking me. I don't think so. He already be disturbed. Now leave me be. Hello, oh, damn kid. Be toil enough as is. What a strange place to be wandering, ain't it? My companion has something to say to ya. Montalon, you are so aggravating. Tis disturbing to my demeanor. A child wandering the wilderness. Surely you must be more too bright to be travelling these roads. And you look a bit scuffed too. A fine pair of travellers all your own. Indeed, I can offer you eating potion if you wish, as token of goodwill. I will be grateful, yeah. Nothing to fear from these simple potions. It will not even hold you in depth, though your conscience knows otherwise. Just like all good people. And perhaps as a payment you will go with us to Nashko. It is a trouble ahead and we mean to investigate some disturbing rumors surrounding the local mines. Some acquaintances are very concerned about this iron shortage. Specifically, where to lay blame in the matter. You will be useful though, I'll not hold you to it. We are to meet the mayor of the town, a name man named Baron Gaskell, I believe. So I will join you, but I must meet someone first. Perhaps you will go with me? We appreciate a little time, but it's best to travel accompanied. I will go with you. You ask for a time though. Okay, so, we got a couple of companions. Goody, take one of these. I don't want you to die just as we start the game. Because these guys are indeed Xantharim. The Xantharim are in opposition to the Harpers. And the Xantharim are evil mercenaries. Well, not that evil, but you get the point. So they will clash with certain companions. I would also like to give you this helmet. At least you will not die to a critical hit. I mean, you probably will die anyways, but... I'm gonna give you a shield. It's gonna give you... One point of armor. And I'm gonna give you the throwing daggers to you. That is because... You start with a specialization. And that specialization is... Daggers. So you can use this one and have... Uh, a base stack of 20 with a modifier of 1. As you can see... Uh, no, that's fine by the, as it is. Uh, you have a dexterity of 16, which is not the greatest. An uh, intelligence of 17, which is, again, not the greatest, but it's close to being the greatest. I mean... And then you have a couple of scrolls here. Can you memorize them? No, you already have a chill touch and a Larlock Minor Drain. These are not great spells, but, you know, we do what we can. Okay, can we move on? Okay, before we move on, actually. Uh, you are a thief, so you can use this one. Before we move on, I would like to give you... Uh, do I want to give you these scrolls? No. You rang. I'm on it. Okay, so we know there are some gibberlings here. And the one it goes to town with the gibberling. Also, you switch. Okay. The Candlekeep Coastway, so this is the road called Candlekeep Coastway, or maybe it's the area called Candlekeep Coastway. What we do know is that there is something over here. I don't know if this is present in Baldur's Gate 1 or not, but it's a diamond nonetheless. And a wolf. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Attack this guy. Alright. I am become death. Destroyer I think. Of worlds. Yeah, it's amazing. Let's speak with this guy. Hmm? 
sorry, Sean, my God, I can't stop the chat. There's another caravan raided. There's been another caravan raided northeast of Beragos. And I must report of these dire straits to the Grand Dukes. A messenger's work is never done. Okay. So, before we actually go to the candle keep in, how about we explore this area and go back to the place where Gorion died? Because there are things we can keep from this fight, like this stuff over here. There you go. More stuff to take. I'm gonna take everything because we can. There you go. A girdle that we might need to identify. And... A bow. Now, we can use this bow so we can put it there. We might need some arrows, so why don't Emoin, why don't you just keep these 17 arrows and give me the remaining arrows. So if we want, this is a short bow though, it's, I do not have competency in this one. So I might give it to Montheron over here. For now. Okay, there you go. Now luckily we can equip it, even if we have a shield on. That's a very good quality of life. I ever saw one. We also got a letter. Gorion's scroll. My friend Gorion, please forgive the abruptness with which I am now write, but time is short and there is much to be done. What we have long feared may soon come to pass, though not in the manner foretold, and certainly not in the proper time frame, as we but know forecasting these events has proved increasingly difficult. Leaving little option other than a leap of fate, we have done what we can for those in thy care. But the time nears when we must keep step back and let mothers take the, what course they will. We have, perhaps, been a touch too sheltering to this point. Despite my desire to remain neutral in this matter, I could not, in good conscience, let events proceed, proceed without some measure of warning. The other side will move very soon, and I urge thee to leave Candlekeep this very night, if possible. The darkness may seem equally threatening, but a moving target is much harder to hit. Regardless of how sparse the cover, a fighting chance is all that can be asked for at this point. Should anything go awry, do not hesitate to seek aid from travelers along the way. I do not need to remind thee that this is dangerous land, even without our current concerns, and a party of... <coughs> Sorry. And a party is stronger than an individual in all respects. Should additional assistance be required, I understand that Jahir and Khalid are currently at the Friendly Arm Inn. They know little of what has passed, but they are ever thy friends, and will no doubt help however they can. Luck be with us all. I'm getting too old for this. E. Let's copy the note, so we can drop this. There you go, we don't need that. Now, let's keep on moving. We can explore a little bit of this land. If we want, please tell me you did not lose your sword. Now you just forgot to equip it. There you go. I'm on it. Is there anything else in this area before we move on? I would rather not explore it, uh, but there is one thing I would like to show you guys before we move on. If I can find it, it should be here. Somewhere along this way. We can definitely look for it. Anytime now. Anytime game. Like, there you go. Chase. Hello, Chase. Don't touch me. I might catch something. Oh, hello. Well, I was about to tell you not to come any closer, but that never seems to do work, does it? Well, regardless, I should remain true to the genre. Don't come any closer, or I'll jump. Yeah, you heard me. And I'll do it, too. So, don't, don't come any closer. Again. And don't try to stop me. By all means, jump if you must. More air for the rest of us. How could you be so callous? I am obviously in pain here. Have you no care for my needs? No, of course not. No one does. Not Mumsy, not Dadoos, not Jeeves. I bet they'd be glad I was gone. In fact, I'd probably be doing them a favor. That's it. I'll stay alive just to spite them. I'll be the most miserable, selfish upstart of a child. Actually, this won't be much of a change. But now I'm justified. Uh, okay. Well... You remember when I said being evil pays? Well, in this case, this guy got lucky. Alright, let's head over to the Friendly Arms Inn. It should be ways here. Actually, you know what would be great? 
if I could tag some uh, terrains, like I did my original game playthrough, it would be nice if we could tag this area over here to the south, so that whenever we feel the need to go there, we can do so. Alright, let's go. There you go, tag it's the high edge, traveling 8, eight hours, Roll don't care. Don't care in the slightest. So, let's keep on moving, guys. We have a date with destiny. Alright, let's go this way now. We can go to the... Whatever this thing is. Okay, we need to go this way anyways. So let's travel. You have been waylaid by enemy. What you want? And we've been waylaid yep. by Gibberlings. Let's kill them all. On their own, do something. Okay, you guys kill these guys. Okay, we did not take any damage, which is good. Which is good. You rang. Right, what's this then? Okay, we got ambushed on the way there. This is amazing to me, but... The good thing is we killed them. And we also got a scroll out of that, which is good. A protection from petrification, I doubt Go this on, is a good assaulted. spell, but... You know. Let's go. Keep going. Oh, there, wonder. Stay thy course a moment to indulge an old man. It's been nigh unto a ten days since I've seen a soul walking this road, and I've been without decent conversation since. Traveling nowadays appears to be the domain of either desperate of the deranged. If thou wouldst pardon my intrusion, may I inquire which pertains to thee? Well. Not to imply anything, but how do you measure up to your own standards? Pestering strangers about their mental state doesn't seem all that well adjusted to me. Point well taken, and thou hast answered my query most adequately. I shall think of thee as a determined instead. I shall trouble thee no more, as thou art more than capable of the task at hand. North is the friendly arm inn, where I am certain thou shalt trust find trustworthy friends awaiting. I have said too much and taken too much time from thee. Fare thee well. Sorted. It is indeed true. This is, by the way, the lion's way. Uh, Elminster, can you find your way? I guess. I suppose. Okay. Just kill them all. And this guy is dead. I do not know if he dropped anything. Can we see? Nope. Alright, let's keep on moving. Let us keep on moving. Oh, there is something here. What is in here? I need to check if these things are, uh, are present in Bodo's Gate. I really need to check. Okay, this is a Ring of Protection, which we can uh, use to get one more armor class. And really, I think we're coming up pretty nicely. Okay. Let's follow the road. We should be getting to the Friendly Arm Inn quite soon. Hello, pal. Hello. If you don't mind, please keep your voice down. There be beasts about with better hearing than we. Uh, let them hear. I'm more than able to handle whatever comes. You will do well to know your own limitations. I don't care whether you're a great swordsman or a powerful wizard. Regardless, you will end up filleted in non noonday sun if you do not take proper care. Move along, will ya? You? you may be intent on digging an early grave, but I have no wish to share it with you. Okay. Illusion of choice. And now we are here. Ready to get into the friendly army. And we shall. The friendly army is over there indeed. Beep boop pop beep pop pom pop pop pom No? No? Well I'm on it. Safe at last. Yes, we can read the journal if we want. We have this quest. They wish to travel me to not to there, and we have to go here and meet Khalid and Jahira. We shall. So we are gonna do just that. In a moment, we're gonna reach our destination, the friendly Armin. And because we are a black guard, the next encounter is gonna be easy for us. 
going to be difficult for the enemy though. Now, Montarot. You have a nice potion here that is a potion of clarity. Now we could use this right now. Drink it a potion. Thank you. What need you dead? Spit it out. Sorted. Hi, friend. Hi to you. Hi, friend. I have not seen you here before today. What brings you to the friendly arm? I am not your friend and my business is my own. How rude. No, really. That is utterly rude of you. I teach you a lesson about manners, but that implies that you are going to live. If I weren't going to anyway, I'd kill you just for being so uppity. And the problem is with the friendly Armin, you get deleted if you raise your hands by the guards. There you go, there's a guard. And this guy is probably gonna die. Quite easy. So, as you can see, he managed to cast Cause Fear, and Zar and Imon are gonna run away. But at the very least, Montaron and the main character resisted the effects. But the main character is actually immune, and Montaron had the potion. Now, we do have a couple of scrolls here. There's a bounty notice. Be it known to all those of evil intent, me, that a bounty has been placed upon the head of Kador, me, the foster child of Gorion. Last seen the head of Candlekeep, this person is to be killed in quick order. Those returning with proof of the deed shall receive no less than 200 coins of gold. That's a little bit, not even a plate mail. As always, any that reveal these plans to the forces of law shall join the target in their fate. Okay. Should they do do. Now, if you guys could stop being in fear, we could probably move on with the, with the thing. Also, I have the poison and the, the absorption thing, but don't need those because we're full HP for now. Are you done, guys? Well, it's gonna take a while. We might as well enjoy the peace and quiet. He spoke at me. I spoke at whoever I want. Yes, I will sleep slightly. Now, is there anything secret while we wait for these morons to recover? I don't think there's anything. And actually, I think uh, they recover. Is there a house in here? I don't think so. Alright, let's go over there. What is this? I don't know, but we need to get inside this, I this inn. Come on, guys. There you go. Go inside. Hey, friend. Good to meet a fine sad such as yourself. Jalopy, uh, sorry, Joppy. I can't stand the way the roads are cut off these days. Me uncle in Borsgate, and I can get there to see him. What does your uncle do? He's a mage and uh, a crockety old one at that. He goes by the name of Ragefast. Though as kids we always call him Grandpa Skin. <laughs> If he ever caught us at it, he'd cast basking on us so we'd wander around all brown skin and green haired and funny looking for a few hours. Wow, I'm, I'm laughing Sorted. my ass off here. What an amazing joke. There is Dorn over there. We're not gonna get Dorn because Dorn is a new character. We're gonna play with the evil party, but it's, you know, in the old ways. Can I open this one? Yeah, thank you, I'll take the potion. Thank you very much. There you go, and uh, we can speak with Sorry. Yes. And your face in this cloistered place. Stand by my side and let's talk for a while. What brings you here, traveler? I was an apprentice blacksmith under Tyrom Fuiruim in Beregos. With the iron situation being it is, however, I thought it'd be better to head somewhere else. What a dip, maybe. Tyrom's having enough trouble making a go of it as it is. Wow. Uh, amazing dialogue. I uh, can't wait to know what else have you got for me. And here are, well, were Khalid and Jahira. Let's speak with them. We're gonna, go, we're not gonna hire them. Wow, the longest possible road. How long must we wait here? Things stir to the south as we sit. Greetings. You, you look familiar, though it's not your looks. I am not sure what I expected. But I believe you are Gorion's child. I am Jahira. This is Khalid. G -g Good to know you. 
We are all friends of your adopted father. Is he not waiting with you? I must assume the worst. He will not permit his only child to wander without his accompaniment. If he is past, we share your loss. Grind of the said that he is worthy for your safety. You know the expense of his own. You also wish that Khalid and I would become your guardians. If he would ever meet an untimely end, however, you are much older now, and the choice of your companion should be your own. We could t t travel until you get settled, help you find your lot in life. It would be a fitting last service to Gorion, though we should first go to Nashkel. Khalid and I look into local concerns. There are rumors of strange things happening in the mines. No doubt you have heard of the iron shortage. You will do well to help us. It affects everyone, including you. We are to meet the mayor of the town, Baron Gaskill. Your company will be welcome. Well, good. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. Though it should be soon. And there you go. Now we have a full party. However, Imoen, my dear Imoen, it's time for you to bite the dust. Because I will not have you. Goodbye, Imoen. Uh, actually, yeah, sure. Go, you don't have anything of value anyways. Goodbye, Imoen. I care not. Good. Just... Just like that, but we're friends and everything. Been friends for years, I guess. I guess I'll just wait till you need me again. Because you will. Just wait and see. Yeah, stay here, Eamon. The friend the army is the best place for you to stay. We're gonna be shopping, and then we're gonna be doing it's stuff. Slow business, Let us sell things. For instance, all of these crawls are quite useless to me. So we're gonna sell all of this stuff. Now, the diamond is a nice find. We could also identify those things, but I don't think... Uh, do I want to sell these things for real? Uh, Infravision, of course. Useless. Burning ends, you know. One thing I would like to do for sure is equip myself with an amazing plate mail which I cannot buy. And that is a problem. We do not have the, you know, proper... Something troubling you? money allotment we can sell these things we don't need those we don't need all these scrolls we can give these scrolls to you so you can memorize them and there you go you have your own potion of healing ah you have your potion of invisibility which i guess you can give to montaron because you don't need that right right and right magic Okay, Monteron, you can sell this wand, though. I don't even know why I have this wand. If I must. No, I need to speak. To open the door, all who behave themselves. Yes, indeed. Wand of magic may sell. Goodbye. Don't need that. Uh, this shoe. Don't need those. Anything else? No. Good. So we can now purchase what I'm looking for, which is the plate mail. Bye. It's just one of the many plate mails we'll get. Now the question is, do I really want to buy this? Eh, I don't know. Perhaps I should have think, thought this through. But whatever. We bought this one. It's good. And anything else we can buy? A lot of arrows, apparently. That's what we need. I'm also gonna need a composite longbow. And perhaps some throwing daggers, if I can find them. If I can find... Where, where are the throwing daggers? There's a dagger, but we don't. I don't see the throwing daggers. He doesn't have throwing... You don't have throwing daggers. That's a shame. But I want the armor. Thank you very much. I will go to minus two armor class. Uh, we can give this to Jahira. Jahira's a leather armor. Not good. Here is your new armor. And that's about it. So everybody here has a nice armor set. I'd say we're all set up for amazing adventures. Go on then. We have one character we have to take. No, 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 I don't want to talk to you. So a few things we can do here. I could do no other. But we're gonna do those in the next episode. Now, I did not memorize enough spells here. Now, Lilac Minor Drain is, anyways, the target creature suffers 4 damage. 
yes, but yeah, he doesn't really have interesting spells right now. But we're gonna be saving, and this is gonna be a new save, and we're gonna call it Let's Play 2. Thank you for watching, guys. See you in the next episode. We're gonna explore around the friendly army and possibly get our latest and last evil companion. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.